Hello and welcome back to Interview with Joe Lisa. My name is Joe. I'm Lisa. And today in the house we have a decent, proper young man who runs different builder construction TV in Jamaica. We think he's awesome and the world needs to know. So go ahead, introduce, introduce yourself. yourself and a little bit about you. Yeah. All right. Um, my name is Delano Brissett. Um, I am 24 year old. 24 years old. I was born November the 13, 1996. Yes, I am a young man. Yes, I know. Uh, I attended Santa Cruz Primary and Junior High School. After which I moved along to Magati High. After which, you know. I came out get a job work. <laughs> Funny, I have fallen in love with construction. Went back to Heart Trust NTA, um, where I did a course in general construction. So that's how um, I get my theory towards construction. Yeah. Otherwise, from that, um, I am a Christian. I do attend church. I. I love my Lord. He has been a, a great person in my life, a wonderful person, like a wonderful spirit. He's a guide. Um, I learned so many things from re um, reading my Bible. I just learned a lot. Like it was, it was one of the most best thing that I have ever done is <laughs> serving God, entering mm -hmm. church. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. I'm so break down right now. I... So break down it is. God has really taken me from nothing. Take a breath, my youth. Take a breath. God is truly amazing. Where I'm coming from, man. Where I'm today. One of the best mom. I just wanna I just wanna just wanna thank God for everything, you know. Delano, you want to take a minute and just, you know, compose yourself a little bit. Just wanna thank God for everything. Come with him. I'm mean, actually kind of a goddamn camera. God is the best, and I cannot complain. Um. Otherwise, from being a Christian, um, hoping to get married to my future wife, my fiance, the love of my life. She has been there for me through thick and thin, you know. And she's the person that I want to spend the rest of my life with. So, yeah, I grew up in um, Santa Cruz, Saint Elizabeth. You know, we got my mother. She's a mother, you know. Big up my little brother. Big up you, Jalisa. Um, you have been an encouragement. Delano, God bless you. We didn't know that this was going to be such an emotional interview. Yeah. But, you know, truly we understand. God is amazing yeah. and sometimes you're just overtaken with emotions when you think of it's God's overwhelming. Goodness. Yeah. That so we understand, yeah, that happens to us sometimes as well. Yeah. All right, Delano, um, 
now that we sort of get used to you and we know what you're about we were looking for some inspirational jamaican youtubers you know and we came across your channel tell us about when and why you started your channel how it came about and so on well i started youtube because i want to share my knowledge about construction and what i have learned theoretically and practically you know so that is the reason why i started you my youtube channel oh so did you always wanted to work in the construction industry delano no 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 because yo construction work hard it worked it too hard back in the days it was rough for me back hurt me hand hurt me go home now i used to my body like all of those stuff it was very hard you know so no i did not like I, I, I was not interested in construction at all. Oh, I understand about the hard work. So what else is there in, you know, in construction for people who love that area but they don't really want the hard work? Yeah. What else? Well, really and truly, I would tell a person that construction, as I said, it's a wide industry and you don't have to do the practical part of the work, which is hard. You know, you can do the book work, like be a quantity surveyor. Quantity surveyor make good money, and that is book work. Um, an architect, they make good money too, like they make good money. And that is book work. You can be a receptionist, that is also book work. So as I, uh, uh, as I said, is, uh, you can also be a secretary. So you can do the, the theory, the book the the office work part of construction and earn good earn a good living a well decent living you know so yeah delano why do you think that so many jamaicans abroad are fearful of mm. building yeah. in jamaica and do you think there's anything being done right now to give them at least some peace of mind yeah yeah that's important well for that is because back in the days contractors usually short change the, um, their clients so that is why persons is afraid to, to build in Jamaica you know I wouldn't say because of the crime I would just say because of contractor usually short change their client but changes have come because now you can't just get up and say that I want to be a contractor I'm or I am a contractor you have to go to school you know get the theoretical of construction know how to learn to draw a plan read a plan and all those stuff so you have to be qualified now you can't just be a contractor or call yourself a contractor oh that's really good so not every time dick and harry can now take up two about them a constructor what can, can Contractor. Can contractor. <laughs> yeah. What else do you think contractors can do to give their clients some peace of mind? Well, for me, I can't really speak for other construction company, but I can speak about my company. But you see, my company give warranty. I because reason why I believe that persons should get a little warranty on their house. So my company give warranty if. You're hiring my company directly. Yes, I give warranty. Actually, five-year warranty. And I tell you the war what the warranty stands for. So I give warranty on my structures. Oh, that's really reassuring to know. So other than the warranty, do you actually sign a contract with your clients? Yes, I do sign contract with my clients because um, I believe in each person should be held accountable for their promises that they they commit to, you know. So yes, I sign contract with my clients. You know, that's really good. According to my friend Judy, mm -hmm. every contract must be on paper, must be written up somewhere and both parties must sign mm -hmm. and then that's 
that's legal what make it a legal binding, binding document. document. Yeah. So that's good. But tell us, what do you see as the positives as well as the negatives of the construction industry? For me, <laughs> that is the joy, the pride, and it's when I can see my clients sm smile about their project when it's being erected, you know? I don't have any negativity, but those are my three positive things towards construction or towards anything overall. All right, Delano, let's say we purchase a piece of land in Jamaica and we want to start building on the land. You know, talk us through the process. What happens? What should we do next? Well, after you have purchased your land and the, you have done all that, all the paperwork, the next step, you, if you want to build your house, right, you would get go to a land surveyor. You would ask him to complete a survey report. Then you will find your architect or your draft man. They will draw a blueprint and you would then submit your join to the parish council. So you will submit the join along, you, will, you the documents that you will carry along with the join to submit to parish council is your surveyor's report, your tax certificate, the join, and basically that's it. The architect normally um, parish council always take four sets of the join and they um, stamp one join, keep back three sets of the join and give you one set. So you be the, the join will only approve of one for one set. So that is the steps you take after you have purchased the land. Then the final step is you hire a construction company. You know, not everybody have the money can hire a construction company, so you can either hire a builder. And as for me, I do provide service as a builder as well, not just as a construction company. So, yeah, that is the process you take. Delano, you sound quite knowledgeable, you know, for a young man. Yeah, we like who are that. some of the people who have influenced you? Who would you say have influenced you growing up? Well, every person influenced me to make me be the person that I am today, you know, because every person had made a massive impact up in my life, you know, so basically, yeah. All right, Delano, hear this one. Who would you say are your top supporters, you know, in this journey, this YouTube and even in life general, who are your top supporters? Well, my top subscribers is Jalicia. Jalicia, you guys are my top subscribers. My um, future wife, which is my fiance, she's also my top subscriber. And my main, main, main top subscriber is me. Like, I always watch my videos when I upload them. It's a joy to really watch myself at work you know so yeah those are my top subscribers those persons big up to you guys thumbs up thumbs up no problem we you know we like to give yeah. our support to decent progressive young people mm -hmm. not even just young but anybody in general who is progressive we and like decent. to give our support yeah right delano we're glad you have a we have you on this spot today because let's say um i want to add on a room to my house in jamaica and i check with a builder and he gives me one price for his quote then i check with maybe three other builders and, and they, they give quote you three different three different way different too yeah what how, how is it you know determined. determined who determine how much is charged i mean help us clear it up because you're so knowledgeable in in, in this regard matters, yeah well Construction company price a project. There is a contractor rate sheet, which is a guide, and that contractor rate sheet, due to inflation, prices are tend to change. So 
but the contractor rate sheet is a guide so we use that to price the labor work and uh, then we add 20 percent to the overall cost of the project which would be labor and material come together and we take and we add 20 percent to, to that money so yeah there's a match to okay mm. so there's a match to the thing yes Oh, but all the, at the same breath, some people twenty yeah. percent, and you know, to the land, or some people twenty percent, some bigger than some other people twenty percent. Not true. Yeah. But anyway, um, do you personally give contracts to your your clients? clients. You mean yeah. sign contracts with mm. you between you and them? Yes, I do sign contract with my clients because. Um, I believe in each person should be held accountable for their promises that they they commit to, you know. So yes, I sign contract with my clients. Delano, we get to the fun part. This is the quick fire round, right? Don't think too hard, don't think too long, just answer when you hear it. First one. Sports. Cricket or football? Well that will be cricket. Cricket, yeah. Mm, cricket. Next quick fire. Country or town? Wow, that's easy. The country. I prefer anywhere in Jamaica. I would rather live in the country than the city because it's crime free, it is quiet, it is cool, it is it's just everything, you know? So I choose the country straight up. Uh, all right. Jamaica or foreign? Some other foreign country. Out of the out of out of my country, Jamaica, I would I would live in my fellow Caribbean country, country which is Bahamas. Yeah, my fellow Caribbean Caricom country, Bahamas. Yeah, I will work with Bahamas. Next one, hard food or rice? <laughs> mm, I think I'm going for both. Yeah, I'm going for both that's it guys so thank you so much though delano for sitting here with us and being you know allowing yourself to be so open and vulnerable, vulnerable. Yeah. and showing your emotions which most men are scared of we really do appreciate you sitting he here and talking open with and us. honest yes yeah. and i think he's, he's a genuine places. young man i think he's going places and i think guys we need to give him our support so his youtube channel is called different builder construction tv please do check him out give him a thumbs up he's growing growing well and doing it slowly show him your support but surely he is growing and doing well and we really want to promote and encourage him so show him your support show him some love in the comments below tell us what you like about his attitude yeah about his progress about his genuine openness as well yes and thank you so much for being with us in another episode of Interview, Interview. with Joe Lisa. Do remember to give this video a thumbs up, a share, a like, and please do subscribe to our channel if you have not yet already done so. Until next time, bye. bye. Well, I like to study more about construction because it is a wide industry, you know? Yeah.